What's up, YouTube? It's Jamie09. So I'm coming up today with the new Dragons of Legend box opening. The wait is over. Um, hoping to get a lot of good cards. I really want the Fire and Ice Hands. Um, sorry that I haven't been making too many videos. I know I say this a lot, but I really do want to make more videos, and I will have Primal Origins coming out soon. This, I was waiting for this to come in. I didn't know if I wanted it or not, um, but it's a really good set. It's a good way to make money off of... There's, there's an easy way to make money off of this set. This set is... Um, Pretty, pretty good for money. It's a lot better than Number Hunters was. Number Hunters, you could make money off of it, but you couldn't make that much money. You just had to wait for that 74, but 74 went down in price really fast. But let's go ahead and get started in this. And it's going to be one of those where it just like bursts open. Um, but, alright, so let me readjust the camera here real quick. Alright, cool. So we got Shadow Impulse. Parasycroid, Train Connection, the Sabbatail, the Philosopher's Stone, and a Mathematician to start it off. Sweet! That Mathematician is awesome. I know everybody loves hearing that word. Uh, it's a really good secret in this set. And Shadow Impulse is a really good super. So I'm going to put these off to the side and put all the good super supers down here and the secrets will be up above. So this is actually a really good card. Uh, Construction Train Signal Red. Uh, if you should read the effect, here, pause the video right here and read the effect, but it's a really good card. Train Connection, line, uh, Lionheart Locomotive, Flash Fusion, and a Mound of the Bound Creator. So I'm going to put all the other ones up there, and then, again, like I said, Super's there. And Better Super's at the bottom. Lilybot, uh, Yuma's friend, one of his only friends, Lionheart, uh, Blackwing, Prominence Hand, and then a Rank Up, Magic, Admiration of the Thousands. That's an interesting card. I really like the artwork on that card, though. So, mainly looking for, obviously, Soul Charge, because, you know, everybody wants that card before Nationals season and all that. Uh, Magic Hand, Soul Charge! Sweet! And then Gate Blocker. I don't even know what Gate Blocker does. Uh, let's look at this effect. Negate the effect of all your opponent's field spells. Your opponent cannot place counters on this card. Your opponent cannot target other monsters for uh, you control with card effects. Uh, it's not horrible. It's just... Not really great, so it's kind of in between. But we got a soul charge that made that pack pretty awesome. Uh, Dread Scythe, Blackwing, Abyss Splash, Battle Fusion, and Shooting Star. Shooting Star is not bad. Uh, I know I'm kind of going fast with these, but uh, I know I'm a little late opening one, so everybody's seen them. Rising Sun Slash, Wiretap, that's a good one. I'm going to put that down here with Soul Charge. Uh, Soul Dog, Parasycroid, and oh, there we go, Curry Bandit. Card just looks awesome. And he works with, he just looks awesome. I just like the way the secret is, where it's like his body isn't secret, but his eye is. So it's just cool. So I go through there with the Mathematician. Looking to pull like a Dark Magician Girl, the Dragon Knight, and all this other stuff. Uh, hopefully I can get some of those. Blackwing Revenge, Magic Hand, another Soul Charge, sweet, and then a Raw's Disciple. That's actually, I'm going to put that down here with these, because it's actually a really good card. And really good for God uh, God card decks, God decks, or whatever you want to call it. And so is Bound of the Bound Creator, but it's just not really, I'm not looking for those at all. But Raw's Disciple's not bad. Guardian Yatos, uh, the one bad reprint. Nobody uses Guardian Yatos. Uh, the Super Splash and Guarded Treasure, not bad. Good card, just... I'm not going to discard my whole hand for to be able to draw two and pray that they don't have an MST because MSTs, they happen a lot. Another wiretap. This looks a lot like the one where I got my wiretap with this. So Soul Dog and Parasycroid. And then, oh, there we go. That is awesome. Legendary Knight to Mice. The card just looks awesome. He actually, if you look at it, he kind of looks like uh, Jaden. If you really look at the eye, uh, without the scar, obviously, but he's got a cool effect. If you look at it, that's actually a really good card to pull. Um, it'll be a lot better when they come out with uh, all the new dragon support thing cards. Uh, Relay Soul, Lilybot, Shadow Impulse, Ice Hand, sweet. I need a play set of these. Um, yeah, that's going to be, it's not going to be hard to get. It's just going to be annoying to get because everybody wants them and it's the new stun deck and it's actually really good. The new Noble Arms, Ayers Rock, and then Express Train, Trolley Ollie. 
Trolley Ollie. I don't know if this was in this side or not. I don't know how many packs I've opened already. I hate how these packs just... I mean, they and they tear easily, which is nice. Blackwing, Blackwing, Blackwing. Awesome. That happens a lot. Prominence Hand and a Black Sonic. Interesting. Black Wings and a Black Sonic all together. It's actually not a bad card, so I'm going to put it down here. I haven't looked at the new Black Wing support. Uh, good cards. Black, Wing, Black Wings is still a good deck, but I don't know what the new support and how, it, how well it works. A Relay Sold. Wiretap. That's good. Put that down here. So I got my play set of Wiretap, which I was looking for. Black Wing and another Guarded Treasure. Rising Sun Slash, which you got to love Utopia cards, because, you know, we, we don't have an abundance of those. Let's see if my theory is right about these. I should have a uh, Soul Charge in this one. Blackwing, and then... Oh, no, I'm wrong. But, oh! Awesome! This card is actually going to be worth something later on. If you really look, you can see all the dragons in the picture. Tamias, um... I don't remember the other one's names, but it's actually going to be a really good card in the future. Legend of Heart. So we've got a lot of good secrets, but also, you know, the bad ones like Charlie Ollie and stuff like that. Ayers Rock Sunrise is a little different. Uh, Lilybot, Blackwing, Sabatel, and then Rank Up Magic, Quick Chaos. Too many Rank Up Magics. Uh, nobody really uses the Rank Up Magics. They're not really used, and... Except for uh, the the new one. I don't remember its name right, right now, but... And then a Mound of the Bound Creator. Uh, Astro Force. Astro Force is actually used because you can use it Pretty well. It gets you new card. It gets it's able. You're able to go from like threes to fives, which is actually really good. Magic hand, shadow impulse, black wing, steam cloak, and another shooting star. Magic hand is actually not bad. If it wasn't on the field, if you didn't have to. The card didn't have to be on the field for it to activate. Shadow impulse, parasycroid, train connection, sabotel, and another mathematician. Awesome. That card is freaking awesome. So. Okay, so that's one carry bandit, one math, two mathematicians, uh, Tamias, Ice Hand, Black Sonic, Legend of Heart. Got some good ones. Uh, I'm still looking for another Soul Charge. So I just want a play set of Soul Charges. I got my play set of Wiretaps, Soul Dog, Guardian Autos, and a Doble Passe from the anime. Uh, Alexis Rose used that, or Rhodes used that, and it's actually a really good card, but just not going to see too much play, I don't think. Soul Sword, Yatos, Relay Soul, Ayers Rock, Final Fusion, and a Fire Hand. Sweet. So that's Ice Hand, one Ice Hand, one Fire Hand, and only four packs left. So it's going to be a quick box opening, um, but it's not a bad pull. Conjunction Train, Flash Fusion, and a Ra another Ross Disciple. I'd rather have another Fire Hand or Ice Hand, but Ross Disciple's not bad. I know people will be looking for those. So another Shadow Impulse. Which is still not, not a bad card. Parasycroid. And a Berserker Soul. You had to get one. Even though it's not horrible. It's really good with uh, Excavator. I think it excavates. So. If it excavates, you can use it in uh, Sylvans. Final Fusion. Blackwing Revenge. Another Soul Charge. There we go. Oh, and another Ice Hand. Sweet. Um, soul Charge. So I got my three Soul Charge and three Wiretap. Uh, it's freaking awesome. I'm excited about that. So, what's this last pack going to be? I'm going to let you guys think about it for a second and let me know what you think this is going to be. The last first edition Dragons of Legend pack that we didn't actually look at the artwork with Tamias right there and the Dark Magician Girl. And yeah, that's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. And last pack. So, Lilybot, Lion Hearted Locomotion, Promise Hand, and a Guardian Dread Scythe. You kind of always get one of these in your box, which isn't horrible. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and do a quick little recap. So we got three wiretaps, which is really good, because it's a good card to have a play set of. Uh, three soul charge. Quickly go through the... Oops. Quickly go through these secrets here. Dread Scythe, Berserker Soul, Double Passe. I'll show you how many I got of, like, duplicates. Not really too many duplicates, though. I did get a couple duplicates over here, but I'm not complaining. So Ice Hand, Raw Disciple, Fire Hand, Legend of Heart, Black Sonic, Ice Hand, uh, Tamias, Raw, and then two Mathematicians and a Curry Bandit. So actually, all in all, this actually was not a bad box opening. Um, I'm really excited for these Ice and Fire Hands. The, uh, these cards will replace a lot of stuff. If you pull this card, 
This card's gonna be really good when the new the new dragons come out. I don't know when it'll be. So the dragons of legend, legends, dragons of legend one and two or two and three most likely when they come out with uh, Hermos and I don't remember the other one's name. Uh, but yeah, so keep these in mind when that comes out, and also keep th these guys in mind because you'll these guys you'll be um, basically summoning. But like, comment, subscribe, guys, and let me know what you think about my pulls. Uh, I know I didn't pull Tamias or Dark Magician Girl or Amulet Dragon or any of that, but with what I pulled, I'm pretty happy with my box. I got kind of a playset of what I wanted. I got a couple cards that I needed and a couple cards that are played really well right now. So like, comment, subscribe, guys, and later.